Hello YouTube. I am today at Brown's Folly, Bath Ford near Bath, better known as locally as Sally in the Woods. To watch where I'm walking, it's a bit muddy. Still haven't dried out there. Sally in the Woods is haunted, which I'll tell you a bit more a bit later. I have got myself a drone, which would be interesting. If anything comes out, I'll we'll have to try it. I thought I'd try it here first. Flipping it, it's a bit, it's a bit boggy here. Should put me other shoes on. It's been dry for a while. Well, I say dry, it hasn't rained. Look at it. Anyway, we shall show you some sights first. See you in a minute. Tree uh, fell over, obviously. Must have been a void underneath it, by the look of it, because well, it's starting to rain now. Because all this area used to be back in the day, 1800s, I think, or before, a quarry all around there so uh, I think they come uh, well obviously there not very far from the surface Brown's Folly, where we're going, is a tower um, built by, uh, built it, it was built in 1845 by Colonel Wade Brown because at the time there was an agricultural recession, so uh, he asked some workers to keep him employed 
to build him a tower. So you know in Lost Lake, like, there it is, I can see it now. I'll just turn you round and I'll show you. Well, when it was built, I'll tell you quickly, it wasn't wooded like it is now. And it's raining, it's getting heavier. This place, the tower, was built for the soldiers in the 18th century for an outpost. And it also says something about the uh, Civil War in 1643, but it wasn't built till 18. 1800s, but it's meant to be haunted. This woods by a young girl dressed in white. And down, down behind the camera on the main road, we come up the back way from Bath Ford, and then up the top of the hill is Moncton Farley, just over to the left there, over to the east of Bath. Um, is where the actual wood is at the top of the hill, but down on the main road, what goes from Bath Eastern all the way out to uh, Trade Bridge is the A363, and uh, the young girl supposedly watches. The cars go past, and then, and then sometimes um, runs out in front of the cars. And on that road, it's quite dangerous because there's been, I think, eight major accidents, fatal, and they make you well. So say. Seven out of the eight of them, so you say, seen a girl run out in a white dress. Whether how true that is, we don't know, but that's one of the myths. Uh, people can hear howls, like wolf howls. Look round and it's gone. And there aren't been wolves in the British Isles for thousands of years. Well, I didn't know how long, but, you know, it's a long time. Somerset and Bath Paranormal. It's a website. Uh, I put a link in, or try to, below. Um, but it's called... The website is called at Somerset and Bath Paranormal 912. They've got a uh, YouTube channel as well, but on their website they've got EVP recordings of around this area. There's fields just down there, as you've seen already, of the uh, area. 
and um, oh, an EVP is an electronic voice phenomenon. Whether they pick anything up, I've listened to some of them, but um, I couldn't make out what they were saying. They also, as well, which I might do, go up to Lansdowne. Don't know if you can see it. Where it's where the sun's shining on that hill on the far. So we're literally facing the end. So we're like side on. Well, no, actually, we can see along the back. So all the way to the right was a battle between the parliamentarians and the royalists of the Civil War. And um, that way's east. West, no, west, sorry. We're in the east. That's looking towards like Wells almost. And Bristol. But the Royalish soldiers come from that direction east, from M M M Marshfield. And. Um, they had a battle, Lans Battle of Lansdowne. Just down there, where the new house is, is, um, well, can you see the cricket field? That's where we walked in our last video, along the Connect Navon Canal. See the um, stone just below the tower here. Well, they must have uh, quarried that. I think this must have been the uh, entrances to the. Uh, or they just dug it outside, out from the side of the cliff. But there's massive piles of. What was probably once rubble here, I'll get on top of it now. But you, you can see the piles from when we were on the top. See what we're on there. And it goes off a long way down there as well. I think along here somewhere there might be entrances to the hillside. Possibly. I've been there for years. I've only been there for months to be honest. That was a good ten years ago. Right, uh, I've just used me um, drain for the very first time, and hopefully um, the video. I haven't got an SD card in it. I've recorded it straight onto my phone. Hopefully, I've used the beginner mode. There's a beginner mode on the drain where it only goes about. 30 meters in each direction from where you're stood including upwards but I've got the tower which is behind me, you're going to get blinded by the sun now over there somewhere got the tower, all of this quarried bit and behind me which is Bath in the distance so uh, apologies, hopefully I've got, going to put it on to this, fit it in with this somewhere video, so 
apologies if the uh, footage is a bit dodgy, jerky if you know what I mean, but apologies if you here are a bit jerky, hopefully it's not too bad, I've just started out, I have been uh, mentioned about the jerkiness, so uh, hopefully I'll smooth it out after a bit of practice. You know how it is, it gets better once you've done it a bit of time, so uh, apologies. I have seen when I stood on the top there. Oh, well, I just stood there, look. And I could see a gate in the side of the face. We shall go and have a look. There's a gate there, look. I'm in Kina. Only a slim person could fit through there. This gate is probably about three foot high. comes up to about my hip and I'm and I'm only five foot seven There, just sat down. Doesn't see much again. 
in this um, Sally in the Woods, as it's known locally, um, is the most haunted wood in England, apparently. And uh, the the girl in the white dress was supposedly um, kidnapped and held prisoner in the tower, I believe. Well, so it says. And um, it's that haunted. The birds don't sing, they say. I've heard plenty. <laughs> I say that, they've all stopped saying. I shall now drive round to... I'll put a map up of the uh, A363 going through the... Um, going through Sally in the Woods. Oh, and the, and the pepper, um, the tower, which we went in, locally, is known as the pepper pot for obvious reasons looks like a pepper pot um yeah i'm gonna drive round the other side where the uh road goes through the woods we're at we're at the back side of the woods is where we parked so uh we'll drive round have a look show you the road and that should be that I shall see you in a minute. Bye for now. Right, I'm right by the uh, road, the main road, the A63. The A363. From uh, Goose of Bathampton and then I to Truebridge. Might get a few beeps, I'll film the road in a minute. But behind me, here, goes up uh, um, a distance, and it's the same the other side of the road. So if you crash there, we're going down a steep pish bank but um yeah I'll show you the road they might think I'm a speed camera or something <laughs> it is for sale look been for sale for years. There you go. Only oh, batteries are going to run out now, so I'm going to call that a day. And uh, I shall see you next week. See you later, YouTube. Bye.